hi beautiful welcome back to my channel welcome back to another vlog if you're new here my name is Isa and I do Christian lifestyle with some self-care and some building up yourself and personal development and all the bits in between because I am a mom as well and I do run a household so do enjoy and thank you for being here so this morning I have already dropped the kiddies at school and it's getting cold out there guys um yeah it's getting kind of cold out there a little bit I never have time to have breakfast in the morning like the kids do but we just busy getting ready getting them ready out the door when we come back that's when we have breakfast and yeah i wanted to just get on the laptop actually and buy some a few bits i was looking over like my previous goal list and things that I need to buy and to do and I remember like well this is a, a, a reoccurring thing but I went into like freshen up my undies and stuff like that so I was looking at H&M to see what underwear they had and I actually end up buying my underwear from George only because the underwear in H&M was super pricey like I bought two packs and it came up to £32 now I went to George which I usually buy the kids pyjamas and I needed to buy the pyjamas anyway so I bought the twins their pair of pyjamas and I bought the exact same thing I wanted to buy from H&M um, and all together came up just two pounds more. So buying just my two packs of underwear from H&M was 32 pounds. Going on George, buying two packs of underwear and two packs of pajamas came up to 39 pounds. You have to find it somewhere, okay? And I know George are good quality because I always buy the kids pajamas from there. They do them in a three pack and a five pack between about 12 pounds and 20 pounds, sometimes 15 pounds, 17 pounds, depending on the time of year and depending on what exactly you're buying. Because as I said, they do, do three packs up to five packs. So yeah, that's what I was doing this morning. Just kind of getting that sorted and buying what I needed to buy. How have you been this morning? I hope you're doing okay. I hope you're wrapping up. It's getting chilly out here. If you're in the UK and if you're elsewhere enjoying the sunshine, please send some this way. Well, <laughs> while I'm having breakfast, while I was having breakfast and doing work, I was catching up on some vlogs. It is Vlogtober, so I'm just seeing what everybody's doing at autumn time. And I need to start doing some stuff in autumn time too, but it's almost like I only have a short time to like get off and do something and I need to find specific things that I want to do that I'm interested in I'm not going to do it for the sake of it I want to actually find something nice to do um, a couple of times in the week as well I wanted to get candles like every single season right and last year Ashley bought me for Christmas um the salted caramel candle from Zara home but when I went to go and buy it it was out because it was a Christmas uh, like a winter candle anyway I was looking through Zara home and I'm going through the candles and stuff that they have because I actually was looking for where the nearest Zara home was the one that is near to us has been closed down and they're closing shops down left right and center now but they close that one down so i was trying to find out the one closest but as i was on there i was like well let me just look at the um you know let me just see the the candles and whatnot and guess what they have oh and i did added they just added the gingerbread too but anyway they've got the salted caramel back here you see they've just changed the um packaging of the candle um, my one's in my bedroom and i had the read diffuser but it ran out And I think I might get the gingerbread and the salted caramel because I've been wanting to get that for a long time. And I know the salted caramel smells nice. And the candle that I actually made at the candle workshop smells in between these candles because um, I chose a, such a like deep warm scent. Like it was butter, buttermilk and biscoffy and it smells just like the salted caramel. Well, kind of like it, but it's kind of like the same family. So it's like, a, I'm gonna wait till Christmas to kind of like, like that one as well but i'm seeing now that they have all the candles back for winter time and 
we need to get the Christmas stuff. I'm more Christmassy than I am autumn. With autumn, I wanted to get like blankets, blah, blah. Have I got the blanket yet? No. Keep coming up again. Oh, I got soap as well. And a car air freshener. Anyway, I just wanted to update if you wanted to have some candles that Zara home brought back the sort of caramel. <laughs> Ashley picked up some flowers for me last night with a box of chocolates and I really cracked that open. Now, as parents, I don't know if you do this, but we have a secret stash of our own goodies. So we have like our drinks, our chocolates, and stuff that we like high up where the kids can't see. And the kids have their one up here and they have one down there that they can access to and have a whale of a time. However, mummy and papa need to have, you know, the nice, nice chocolates. <laughs> So yeah, he bought me some Lindor chocolates yesterday and I love white chocolate, right? And I love hazelnut. So this one has hazelnut, extra dark, white chocolate and the normal milk chocolate. So I cracked into a white chocolate and a hazelnut last night. Just a little something because I don't like even eating too many sweet things in the evening. I'm watching Love is Blind and my favourite couple, there's two black couples in there and the lovely, lovely, dovey one because I can't remember their names, but the lovely, lovely, dovey couple they're so like sweet and mm, they're my favorite and there's another black couple however the guy is starting to annoy her a little bit because he keeps like making jokes that are not funny and it's hard you know you know you meet someone you're still like meshing out and figuring out who you are etc but hey what what can i say it, i'm enjoying love is blind i've watched every single one we tried to watch love is blind korea or japan but the subtitles was annoy me so <laughs> I just left that but we have watched the UK one and all the ones so far and I can see that there's many different countries I think there's oh we watched Love and Island Brazil oh that one was spicy that was really really nice but um it was as because it's in Brazil isn't it so it was like but um yeah anyway let me undo and get these flowers in some I've got everything done that I needed to do whilst Ashley was picking up the twins and guess what I have another donut so I warmed up because if you're not warming up your donuts then I don't know what you're doing but you must warm up the donuts this is a, again another salted caramel with the white chocolate on top and I think this is like a cinnamon glaze anyway
Skincare is all done and don't forget to moisturize your lips as well so I'm just gonna spend the evening as I usually do with a cup of tea something to watch and chilling with Ashley I also have some Cinnabons this evening that I got from Tesco and they're so yummy and of course I have to warm them up if you're not warming up your sweetie bits then I don't know what you're doing we have a new purchase I got the shark vacuum and we're just kind of checking it out and unboxing I'm just looking at the pretty Claire stuff I'm just so in love with Claire things but actually put it all together for me and it is amazing it's pretty heavy though and it also has a 360 turn so it's easy to get round but yeah, that's our evening done for today and I'm just going to relax with a cup of tea. Mm -hmm. 